Hello, hello friends, welcome back. Um, I've been doing a lot of work today, but then I also got to see the new Little Mermaid, which I thought was amazing. I loved it. Melissa McCarthy as Ursula is, yes. I'm a diehard Little Mermaid fan. Um, I'll show you. So my brother got me this for Christmas. And uh, yeah, so I love the Little Mermaid. The thing that's really awesome, this is one of those, um, Oh, what are they called? Lounge fly. They're called lounge fly. But the thing that's awesome about this one is it lights up. Let's see if it'll catch on the camera. Boom! Fireworks. Yeah. So like I'm a diehard Little Mermaid fan. Have been came out two days before I was born. So obviously it was good. Um, but I really liked it. And live actions are always different anyway so I was okay with the changes they made like they kept a lot the same but then they also made some kind of cool changes which I always appreciate um, but anyways why I wanted to make this video is I got my first Timu order now I've been hearing all about Timu everybody freaking out thinking it's amazing I try to avoid shopping online in kind of like the big box stores. Like I try to avoid Amazon and different things like that as much as I can. Um, obviously I'm on a budget, so sometimes I do have to kind of crack down and go for the cheapest option, which isn't always the most ethical option. Um, so I've, I haven't done a ton of research on Timu, but it seems like it's pretty legit. Um, there were actually a number of things I needed in the kitchen, uh, a few things I needed for Daryl for his job. So I thought I there was this huge coupon uh, that somebody had shared with me and I thought, you know what, let me give this a shot because I got a ton of stuff for super cheap, so why not? So this is going to be my Timu, my first Timu haul. Um, I have another bag coming, but for now, we will see how this goes. Without further ado, let us dive right in. And then I've got, oh, I've got like a little mic here, so maybe I can give you a little AS ASMR here. I don't know how that sounds, so hopefully it's good. Let me put this back before I continue to talk. I went and I got the list so that I would know um, what I got and prices and everything did okay ready to go all right so i'm really excited actually um one of my best friends mandy she was the one who told me about it and uh she was like kayla it's really really dangerous and i was like oh you know i, I you know i can do pretty well i'm such a thrifter thrift shopper that i was like eh, you know i'll i won't i won't worry about it and then i checked it out because they had this crazy amazing all these deals and so I went on there and Mandy was 100% right. It's very, very dangerous. Very, very dangerous. So, here we go. I'm just gonna kind of pull everything out. The first one is this cute little water bottle. It's for your hair. Um, I've been wanting one like this and this is super cute. I really like it. Really simple. This one's a little slimmer than the one I have in my bathroom, which kind of takes up a lot of space, and I felt like this one might be a little bit better. So this one was, um, this one was, so this is what I paid. This is like after discounts and everything. This one was $3.48. That's not bad. And it comes in multiple colors. Oh my gosh, I'm super excited about these. Hold on. All right. Zephyr's in the background, super confused. These are glasses, like cute glasses, okay? So I I have an issue in my left eye, I think it's called keratotonus, and really the only way for it to get fixed is by a, um, like a literal transplant, not the whole eye, but like the cornea transplant. So uh, since, <laughs> since that is not in the budget, because I don't have health, health insurance, um, I literally am just praying for healing and believing for healing. But that doesn't mean that I don't like cute glasses. I have a couple pair of glasses that don't really do anything anymore. 
and I saw these and I thought, you know what? These look so cute. Here they are. Oh my gosh. And they're pretty sturdy. I mean, they're not, they're not like high end, but let's see how I look in these. Oh my gosh, I actually like those. I didn't know how I would look in like really big glasses, but I really like those. Those are really cute. So they don't do, they're not even like the blue light glasses. They're just like, they're literally just basic glasses. Let's see how much it cost me. Boop, 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 boop. Da, 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 da. Oh, 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 they are blue light proof. I lied. So I can wear these while working. That's awesome. These were $2.09. $2.09. I really like these. These are really cute. Oh my gosh. Is that, let me see if I use this word right. Like, this is a moment? Is that, am I using that right? It's a moment. Correct me, young, young people. Correct me, young people, did I use that word right? <laughs> Anyways, these are super cute. Okay, I'm really excited about these because I saw a double pack on Timu. These guys, Scrub Daddy. So like, this isn't the, this isn't like the official Scrub Daddy as obvious, but I do love these. I don't know why I smell. Those are really cute. Um, yeah. The thing that's really nice about these is I have a metal straw and so the, these are for straws and then like these are for like forks and spoons. So you put the spoon in there and then you squeeze. They're really nice. So we needed more of these. So I'm glad that I went ahead and saved and got those through Timu. Those cost me $1.47. $1.47, baby. Nothing to sneeze at. Okay. What's this? Oh, it says right there. Oh, there it is, electric toothbrush. So the story behind this one is uh, about two or three weeks ago, I went to go see my brother graduate from college. I'm really like, I'm really quick when going through security, but because they were so busy and there were so many people around me, I just like, I took everything out of my bag, threw it in the little buckets and then like boom, 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 and then was gone. Well, I forgot my little toiletries bag, which had my favorite brush. I had to replace that one. My pro's curly cream. I also forgot my electric toothbrush. Instead of buying a brand new one at the store while I was on Timu, I was like, you know what? Since we're going all in, let's go ahead and check to see if they have one. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Okay, so this one is electric. Look how cute that is. Am I gonna have to do that thing that influencers do? Is this how they do it? Pfft. There's like six different settings or something on this thing. Oh, and it comes with, it comes with four different brush heads, which I know you're supposed to change out the heads to your toothbrush. Like, I think, I think it's supposed to be like every three months. Mm, how, guess how often I change mine, like every year, which is bad, I know, I know. But maybe because this one is so cute, I'll do better. Let's take a gander at how much it was. Let's see. Oh yeah, $6.74. So it's, um, you plug it in to charge it. So it's rechargeable, ultrasonic, electronic toothbrush. It has six settings, um, four replacement brush heads for $6.74. I'll take it. Next. Ooh, I'm excited for this one. So I got this little guy. Now I'm curious to see if this will actually work or if it will fall to pieces. This one looks cool because it's supposed to, okay, so it's supposed to clip. Oh, okay, I see how it goes. So it actually clips onto, you squeeze the back here and it clips onto the rear view mirror. So it clips on the back of it. And then you put this little guy in here, or this way, there we go. I'm missing a screw. Ah, there it is. 
But as you can see kind of in this picture, this is where it goes on the, um, this is the rear view mirror, and then it kind of hangs down, and then you put your phone here, and then that kind of turns 180. I'm really hoping this one works because I really do love vlogging in the car. Let's take a peek. This one and the final price, drum roll please, is was $5.17. I'll take it. Oh my gosh. I remember what this one is. Okay. This one is kind of silly, but like when I looked at it more and more, I was like, this is actually incredibly practical for me at least. So, so, there it is. I am smarter than the bad. I am. I cut my husband's hair. This will be amazing because right now I set him up in the bathroom right before he takes a shower, I buzz it, and then I bring in the vacuum and vacuum everything up. This is this really cool thing if this is what I think it is. Yeah, 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 this is the right one. Okay, so this is supposed to like catch all of the hair. Does it go this way? I need to see the picture to see how it works. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so, you know what? If this doesn't work out, this could be a really great cosplay outfit for something. <laughs> so it's supposed to kind of turn up. I don't know how, but basically like this so that it catches the hair. It catches the hair and then it's easier disposal. Supposedly. $2.08. So I thought like, you know what? For $2.08, I will give it a shot. Why not? Why not? Next one. What's this? Oh, I know what this one is. There's this cute little thing here. Oops. So it lifts up. And you put the lid here and then the spatula next to it. All right, so let's say that I'm cooking. This is supposed to be, I think it's like this. Gosh, maybe this isn't. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Here we go, here we go. I don't know if you can, I will turn it. So this is kind of how it works. So when I'm cooking, I can set this down so that I'm not setting it flat. I usually just set it flat here. And then I like that. I actually really, really like that. And that one was $3.17. And it's like, it's green and gold. Alrighty, what is next? What is next? Oh, I'm excited. Okay, I remember what this is. This is this cute little thing for the sink. So one of the things I hate as well is I'm actually, I'm not a clean freak at all, but there are some random things that really, really bother me. And when you set like the sponge on the actual side of the sink, I don't like because then it creates like, it's just weird. So this is actually for this. Look at that. So it goes around the neck. I don't know why I did that. Around the neck of the faucet, around the faucet, and it hangs so that it drains. Cause see there's holes down there. It drains and then you can just get there, but it's silicone. It's really cute. $2.99. That one was $2.99. I don't know what this one is. It's like, I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't tell me what it is. I low-key forgot and then remembered and then forgot again that I got this. This is for vlogging. I was just gonna stick with recording with my laptop and my phone, but then I saw this and I thought for that price, I'm willing to give that a shot. So basically it's an off-brand GoPro. This is exciting. 
Here's the thing though. I read tons of reviews on it. There are tons of them, very high reviews. And everybody said that it was worth it. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. That is really cool. So it's waterproof. I've always wanted one of these. I always wanted a GoPro just because like, I also thought like, I thought it'd be fun to do one of those videos where you, um, you like attach it to your dog and see like from their point of view. I don't know, I just thought that was like, I just always think it's cute. Plus I do like the idea of taking photos underwater. Like I've always thought that was cool. So this I'm really excited about. It's waterproof to 30 meters. It's full HD, 1080p. There's a, there's a storage card that this one comes with. It says it's not included, but it told me that it comes with one. So if not, that's okay. I actually have like tons of SD cards, so it's not that big of a deal. So this is awesome. I used to be a photographer. Um, that's another story for another day. I used to be a photographer, so I used to have a really nice camera, but then I ended up selling it because I was making no money. <laughs> so I sold it uh, to pay bills. And so this is kind of a way to get back into photography, but in a more like for vlogging and moving around, I feel like this is gonna be really cool. And it has up to an hour and a half of charge. So it's not super robust or anything like that, but for just simple stuff, I feel like it's gonna be really cool. I really actually super duper excited for that one. Like, I'm gonna feel real cool. Like, I'm gonna feel like a pro, man. Like, you know? Yeah, if you're gonna be on this channel for any length of time, you need to know that I like to speak in accents a lot. Oh, I forgot to tell you how much it was. This one, it's, um, comes with a 32 gig card was $24.18. And you know, GoPros, now GoPros are worth what they, they're priced at. I'm not saying they're not. But as you know, GoPros are significantly more expensive. So for 24 bucks, heck yeah. Heck yeah, I can't wait to try that one out. Super excited. Oh, I know what this one is already. Ah, super excited. So the thing that's funny is this one has a lot of like cleaning products. It will come to learn about me very quickly is that I I really am not a neat freak. Now that we're in a one bedroom apartment, I try to keep our space not as cluttered. I don't like clutter. I don't mind a little bit of organized chaos, but I don't like clutter, like to where there's stuff on every surface so that you can't use that surface. I'm getting a lot of stuff for that, but this one I'm excited about. This one is one of those, it goes around um, the front or around the faucet, the kitchen faucet. And again, <clears throat> remember how I said I don't like putting the the little scrubbers on the thing because I just don't like, yeah. This helps with like, if we ever just need to set like a knife really quick there so while it dries, this is just really nice. So it goes around the faucet. But look at that color. It's not picking up the full color, but it's kind of like a, I don't know. It's just this really beautiful green. I wish you could really see the full color. That's pretty close. I'm excited about this. Let's check the price. So this one I got for $5.28 and it is silicone. It's the large one. So the smaller ones were cheaper, but I wanted a larger one to go across the whole sink. Oh my gosh. Okay. I have seen these on the internet, on the Instagram, everywhere. And I've been wanting to try these out. I had checked out and what else would just pop up and say, hey, do you want to add us to your cart for like, you know, really cheap? And I was like, you know what? Yes. Yes. I was late on the air fryer bandwagon, but now I'm a convert. So maybe you already know. The only thing I don't like about air fryers is cleaning them. Of course, I hate cleaning period, so obviously, but these guys, they're like, so you put these in the bottom of the air fryer, you put your food in there, and then it's, 
It's clean, supposedly. Now, honestly, I thought these were gonna be, I thought this was gonna be a little thicker and I thought it was gonna fold up because in the pictures, it kind of looked more like a really big coffee filter. Um, so I'm not sure how I feel about these. I mean, let's check. They were $1.88 and there are 50 of them. So, I mean, worse comes to worse, I just don't use them or use them for something else, but I'm kind of excited about those. I'm gonna try those out. I'll have to let you guys know how those work out. <gasps> There's something hiding underneath those. I don't know if you can see it. So this goes in your phone like this, and then it has slots for memory cards. So if I wanna transfer, which I actually really do because I have like 32,000 photos on my phone. <laughs> Don't ask me. Um, I wanna transfer them and then like just right on the actual SD card, like, you know, these are these photos and then delete them. I don't, you know, like how many pictures of the sunset do we really need in our phone? I don't open them up and look at them. I'm excited about this because there are pictures that I would like to keep and by putting them onto a memory card instead. Remember, I used to be a photographer, so I have a bunch of extra SD cards that I could probably just use. So I'm excited about that. So that one was $3.38. We're getting closer to the end, but there's a lot here. It's a box. It's a box. What's in the box? What's in the box? Name that movie. Hmm. It's kind of a really messed up movie, but it was also very good. Okay. If this is what I think it is, I'm really excited. Again, there's a bunch of organizational stuff in here. And like I said, I'm not really big into like organizing and stuff. How does this work? Mm -mm -mm, let me look at the directions. Okay. Oh, that's how it works. Oh my gosh, this is even cooler than I thought. Okay, so the first one, it's a three piece set. This one is a um, cotton swab or cotton ear, no, Q-tips. This is a Q-tip dispenser with a bamboo top, a little simple bamboo top. So if you can see that, just clear. This one is for, this one just for cotton balls, I guess it said. But the one I did not realize this, this made the set even better because I didn't even realize this. This is a cotton swab dispenser, okay? So do you see how there's a little in here? So for those flat cotton, cotton swabs, the flat ones that you use for like makeup and stuff, you put them in here and then you just pull, I think from the top maybe, you pull it out of the side. That is wicked cool. This one was... Drum roll, $7.18. That's not bad. That was actually one of my more expensive things aside from the camera, which obviously I knew that was gonna be more expensive. Okay, these are just really cute and I hope they're as cute as they, I, I hope like they work the way they show in the pictures. So these are for your, oops, this way. These are for your cup holders in your car. So you put them in the cup holders and it's just like, look how cute that is. And basically the only purpose is that they're cute, <laughs> which for me is pretty typical. Ask my husband the number of things that I do because I think it's cute. It's a very high number. This is also for the car. <laughs> I'm just laughing because I, I just, I'm not like a hardcore organizational person, but everything that I got was hardcore organizational person kind of stuff. But this is actually stuff that I've put off for a really long time getting where I saw and I was like, actually, that's really practical because that's stuff that I would use on a daily basis. So, ah, there we go. Okay. So a few years ago, maybe it was a year ago. It might be a few years ago now. Um, we have a very old car. It's very old. It's a 2004 Toyota Tacoma. I mean, that thing is gonna run until it dies, like literally. It's it's a great, it's a great truck, love it. 
It's going to last a long time. So this is not complaining in any way. But there is going to come a time where we need a new car. And Daryl and I have been wanting a new car for a while. We're a one car family. And a year ago or so, I just felt really convicted. Like, I just felt like God said, be, you know, take good care of what you have now. And he prompted me to get a, um, a um, car wash membership, which I was like, God, you've seen our car. Why on earth would I get a car wash membership? And it was like, you need to do this because this is showing that you are going to be a good steward of what you have now and be grateful and like be happy about what you have. Not saying that um, there's not blessing coming still and to work hard for that, but like you've got a car and it works and it's a really robust vehicle. So treat it well. So um, one of Daryl and I's favorite things now is to take uh, the truck in to get washed. We love going through the car wash and then we vacuum everything and wipe down the windows. So this is for the windows. It's a microfiber towel for the inside. Cause I can't, I'm short, I have short arms. So this is supposed to like wipe the window so I can get it, get to it easier when I Windex the windows. Didn't know you wanted a soap opera story after that, did you? Okay, this was $2.07. So I will let you know if this is worth it. But for $2, why not? Give it a try. Bum, ba, da, da, bum, chow. It's one of those little frother things. I don't know what the technical term is. This says it's a cappuccino maker. Oh, yeah, it doesn't have batteries. So I have to add batteries, but I see people with these all the time. And I'm like, every time I see them in the store, they're really, really expensive. And I'm like, I mean, why? Why though? Dollar 78. This one was a dollar 78. That is the end. That is the end of my Timu haul. And honestly, I'm, I'm not disappointed. I will let you know how all of these go. Like I, I'll actually have to test them out and kind of give reviews and see um, if they kind of hold up. In my opinion, even if it turns out <laughs> like the, the haircutting thingamabob, like even if that doesn't turn out to be, it's like, okay, for $2, like, no big deal. Some of these seem like they might be a really good deal. Like a like a legit dealio. Well, thank you so much for stopping by. Please like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification if you'd like to see more. Um, I've just kind of gotten started, so there's gonna be more coming. I have a lot of fun ideas. Um, let me know down below in the comments if you've ordered from Timu, um, if you've had a positive experience or not. I'm just, I'm curious. I would love to know your thoughts as well. All right, friend, will you have a great day slash evening slash morning slash whenever you watch this and I will uh, see you soon. Okay.